out today. We're in Dayton. We're uh, currently on our way to a dealership, to the service garage, to have my uh, used car that I just bought looked at. I've already had it at the dealership once, at, you know, three days after I bought the vehicle, and now it's going back to a different dealership to be looked at because the dealership that I bought this from was a Ford dealership and they said they didn't have the proper equipment whatever to work on this vehicle so uh, yeah let me show you what's wrong with this travel down 35 and we're doing like 160 I'm really just blasting it but in all actuality, I'm doing 56. Yeah. Speedometer's kind of dicked. Ugh. So, I've researched this online. 2004 Chevy Impala has problems with the dash clusters. It's not a recall thing, but most of the time it's a uh, something going wrong with the dash cluster. So, so we know it's going to happen when I take it to the dealership. Most likely they're going to tell me I need a new dash cluster. Hopefully the dealership that I bought it from will okay it and they will pay to have this thing fixed because it's going to cost me somewhere upwards of $300 to have this dash cluster replaced. <coughs> and if you look up here, the cruise control is set. And, <laughs> and I'm traveling along at 55, so this is kind of crappy. So the communication between the sensors to the computer and the computer to the dash cluster, the, the problem is between the computer and the dash cluster. So hopefully, oh, you know, I got to tra travel 35 miles to go to this dealership. Hopefully they'll give me another freaking vehicle to drive home if they're going to keep it. It's, you know, this ain't safe. Hold on, I'm getting ready to stop. And, uh, well... At a full stop, this thing's like doing 85, so, well, we'll get off here and see what the dealership is going to say. It's like, look, we're doing 20 miles per hour right now, but we're standing still and getting gas. That don't work. I know it ain't one of my uh, normal videos that I kind of put up, you know, some kind of repair or something to do with Derbyan. But, uh, yeah, if you ever get like a 2004 Chevy Impala, or I even hear it's on some of the trucks too. But, you know, if your dash cluster's messing up, it's probably screwed and, and they, they can't be fixed. They have to be, uh, they can't be fixed from my knowledge from what I've gotten today that they they have to be totally replaced with a brand new one so they'll get that in overnight it put in and then I can take this piece of crap Ford Fusion back and uh, I can have my car back so well uh, I'm gonna get out of here and uh, get me some munch on and then I'm gonna go home and relax and then go to work tonight and then tomorrow sometime I'll go pick up my car so all right, later on.